CAL FIRE SAYS THE Cheyenne FIRE IN CALABARAS COUNTY IS NOW 50% CONTAINED AND EVERYBODY WHO WAS EVACUATED IS NOW BACK IN THEIR HOME TONIGHT. IT TURNS OUT THOUGH THAT FIRE WAS CAUSED BY A SPARK FROM A LAWNMOWER. IT DESTROYED TWO TRAILERS BUT FORTUNATELY NO HOMES. ABC 10'S WENDY AGUILAR TALKED TO ONE FAMILY WHO WAS COUNTING THEIR BLESSINGS TONIGHT AFTER THAT WILDFIRE LITERALLY SURROUNDED THEM. The Cow Grow Up Ranch is a nonprofit organization filled with animals and people like Mary Beth Weefels, who are passionate about helping others. So we do women's empowerment and youth camps, and we do, in fact, after the Butte fire, we were an evacuation center, and then we also provided counseling for survivors of the Butte fire. Beth was in the middle of a writing lesson when she saw smoke and fire coming towards the ranch. We came up here and started fighting the fire over on on this area by that time the fire the only firefighters that had gotten here were trying to protect the house so now we were trying to protect our various um, areas because the wind was blowing it in lots of splotches all over the place and the fire was amazingly tall I, uh, I just remember looking around me and seeing nothing but fire. Esther Bracora is thankful for the work of all the firefighters and her brave neighbor who she says save the day. He drove through the fire and made a fire break so we didn't lose our buildings back there. Within minutes, the fire surrounded the ranch and quickly moved across the street. But the ranch and all their animals <laughs> were safe. Even though the family lost many items in here, like Christmas decorations and photo albums for many years, the family today is thankful to be alive. You figure out really fast what's important and it's, there's not much you're going to take with you. Reporting from Burson, Wendy Aguilar, ABC 10 News.